What the actual fuck did I just witness? That that was like the room levels of Oh my god my eyes. Uh oh my god my everything else. Fuck 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 Okay, that's not ideal. No, no, you can't have my wallet. Fuck off. Okay, hang on a second. Let me just let me just I am trying to have a moment here, okay? Could you please just fuck off? Right. Right, um So what we just witnessed was uh two people entering into a room, discussing shit that was apparently plot relevant, but without listening to one another, so the whole thing just sort of fell flat on its fucking face. Um So there is a virus. A virus that creates rage. Cool. Use that as a biological weapon. Drop it onto enemy for into enemy territory. That all makes perfect sense. Making it genetically inherited makes absolutely no fucking sense. If the if the initial design of it is to make more is to make people homicidal, because when you be, when people are homicidal, you're unlikely to get your end away. I mean, unless they are implying something else there, in which case, holy shit, that's dark. But um. Yeah. Also, I'm realising we are heading backwards, uh, back through the route that our original guide came from. So I'm assuming all the soldier stuff is actually a massive flashback, but up uh, back before he actually got to the got to the lab, got shot, and then became the fucking superhuman soldier. Just calling it here. But um, good fucking grief! I ha I have not seen a cutscene that totally failed to uh, make me understand anything that was happening. Also, flaming tires. Um, oh, that's the Hunting Human H Human Hunting Association. Like, okay, this is this actually brings up something quite interesting here. So there is a rage virus going around that's infecting all these people. That's cool. Now, does this mean that everyone has gone entirely feral? Like, I can only assume because I'm being attacked by everyone. Or does it mean that it is um, amplifying their just latent desire to commit to commit pain and attack people, like lowering their inhibitions? Say, like Crossed. Uh, by the way, if you do not want, if you do not know what Crossed is, for the love of God, do not research it unless you have a very strong stomach. I I would happily have those memories deleted um, because this leaves me the distinct impression someone's run running a fucking printing company in an apocalyptic Russian hellscape. Just so they can pop open their human associ human hunting association posters all over the fucking town. I don't know about you, that seems a little much. Also, those teeth are just unnecessarily creepy. Um, was that was there actually anyone in here, or was that just? Wait, hang on a second, because I. There we go. Because I'm pretty sure I broke these walls on the way out. Hang on a second. Come on, come on. Because now the continuity is starting to... Okay, that has actually thrown my sense of continuity out. Is this a flashback? If it is, then they repaired the walls. Which just suggests even more fucking infrastructure. Also, holy shit, I feel like I'm a fucking conservative going for a low-class neighbourhood right now. It's like, oh look, we can see the proles in the natural environment. Blat, blat. Oh dear, well, might as well take all your stuff. Anybody else? On the very, at the very least, I'm now fighting regular mooks again, and I'm not fighting bunches of arseholes with guns. I'll happily take that. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm wasting my time here. I need a shotgun for this. I'm going to be shooting the lower class. Hunt them down like foxes. Hang on a second. Fuck. All of you. Hang on a second. Come on, come on, come on. Fuck off. Nobody wants your big issue. Alright, where are we going? Get nothing through there. Also this, like, again, this has not been explained. Is this supposed to be general graffiti? Fuck off. Or is this supposed to be, like, pre-existing? <gasps> Fuck off, you ugly little shit. Right. I just, I, I don't fucking know. In the bleak, blasted, post-apocalyptic hellscape, there is only printing companies and really bad clip art, clip art logos. God almighty. Right. Anything around here? No. Right, well... I know generally where I need to go, I'm just trying to work out... That, like, this has really thrown me now. Like, is that broken wall just genuinely developer incompetence, or is it something more... Insidious. Insidious. Ow! Ow! Where the fuck did you arseholes come from? Is there a convention I didn't know about? Fuck off! Fuck off! Come on, come on! 
Last one alive buys a special brew. Come here, you fucker. Oh! Did you see his head snap back? Oh my god! Like, this game is un unintentionally brutal sometimes. Okay, no one behind me. Grab this. Oh, got some more clips for the uh, clips. Fucking magazines. Uh... Oh god, okay. Well, for a moment there I thought I had triggered them. No, no, they were just waiting for me to, they were just waiting to finish their last animation. Then they'd go and kill me. Come on, you fucker. Have some of this. There we go. Right. Well, if I'm going to be doing it, I might as well do it properly. Oh, I've got a... I'm a, I'm a fine pistol, I might as well use it. Uh, slightly annoyed I can't use my, um... I can't use these hatches, because I can only assume those actually be slightly more effective than my piss weak goddamn pistol. Come on! Oh dear! Oh dear! Hang on a second. Line it up, line it up. There we go. And don't forget to double tap. Two things you must always remember in life. Don't forget to tip your waiter and always double tap the undead. Right. Assault rifles. Let's load this all up. Got a feeling. No? No mooks around there. The switch closing the lock door. The dock doors is in the cabin. Well, no shit. I figured at least that much out. I've played this level before. Oh, dear. Right. Actually, this would be a good point to check. Is the. Is the harbour down the way? Oh. Yeah, the ship's. No, wait a second. Ah, no. Wait, what? The ship's facing the other direction. But the docks are closed. Okay, I'm, I'm really fucking confused right now. Um, ah, right. So, go up here, close the locked doors. Making sure I don't get murdered by mooks in the process. Is there anybody in here who fancies a tickle? Oh, Jesus, a lot of blood there. Aha! Wait. Is that a non-lethal explosion? Or are you guys just incredibly durable? Sit down. Sit down. Fuck's sake. Alright, well, that worked, I suppose. There we go. Okay, well, there's a radio here. Don't suppose I can call for help. Nope, fuck that noise. Okay, so through here. Aha! Goodies. I will help myself to these. Ah, absolutely. Right. Wait. Where's the switch? Am I going senile here? Ah, no, it's over here. Do, 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 do. Right. Let us G through the T to the F and the O. Well, G to the F and the I am technically getting in. Oh, god damn it, fucking doorways. Like, I. The, the really stupid thing is, and I. Because I saw some of the walkthroughs, nobody else was having this issue. I think the game is rolling out the red carpet in terms of jankiness just to fucking appease me. Or frustrate me, I'm not entirely sure how it wants to slide this. There we go. I'm assuming you're all dead. If you twitch, you're good. Let's have a look here. Cool beans. Right, everyone over here is dead. Let's just clear this area first, make sure we're not going to miss anything else. Oh, yep, lots of dead mooks over here. Is there anything in the back for me? Let's have a look-see. Apart from a man diligently attempting to suck his own dick, apparently no. Alright, fine, let's go. Back through this way. So, um... I mean, I mean honestly, like, have we... I mean, we, we apparently killed our captain off-screen. I mean, fine, if that's the way you want to pull it, then fine, we can just we can just kind of accept, just swallow that you just erased the character from the, from the from the plot, but I'd have much rather we actually saw at least some of that happen, so I'd have at least a little bit more agency in the plot, but fine. Okay, something has killed all these people, and it wasn't me, because I don't remember killing homeless people and monkeys when I was escaping that, when I was escaping that lab. Just a statement I didn't think I would actually be making today, but okay, fine. Right, where are we going? Where are we going? Uh, I've got a feeling I'm jumping onto that box there, but let's just check around here first. Oh, no, it could be one way or the other. Well, I've got a feeling it's this way, though. Right, go, go, go. Go through here, maybe? Nope, not through there. Um. No, right. Go through here. Yeah, there is... Am I missing something really fundamental here? Because I feel like I've just gone everywhere I could. And there's... Because the thing is, this, play, this game does not really signpost you at all. It does not say, go here. It says, here's a big open space. Do what the fuck you like. The level opening the gate, the lever, to Glacier must be somewhere near it. Okay. 
Nearby lever, nearby lever. You can tell all these tips were brought up, like, way into the testing process. It's like, well, we clearly can't, um, we clearly can't change anything, because we've already kind of fixed it all into, like, beta. But, aha, right, there we go. We can add, like, basic tooltips in there to make it a little bit easier. Oh, look at that. Look at that texture clipping. That is fucking glorious. Slip it in. Um, I'm assuming this is where I need to go. Just head towards the incredibly low poly texture at the end of the tunnel. Glacier. Okay, that's all. I've left the most terrible things behind. Now I only have to meet Danilov's team. At least, at, la at least I'm going to leave this territory of dusk. At last? Like, the, the overall quality of writing um, and general spell checking in this game has just dropped through the toilet in this last bit, but... <laughs> Excellent furly work on those footsteps there. Very nicely done, guys. Where are you right now? Stage minus two of Glacier Object. The cryogenic hibernation room. It's hard to miss. Got it. Be careful. There are still hostile creatures in the rooms. Ruh-roh! Ruh-roh! <laughs> Well, now that I've got a gun, it may be a bit easier to, uh... Waiting for you. Over. Over and out. Yep, yep, yep. We know, we know. Okay, so, we're back in here. Wow! Okay, this now puts the, um, the weakness of the original gun... Dude, ah, oh, no, hang on a second. Okay, these guys are a little bit tough to take out. Come on. And apparently we have no music for this section as well. Not totally sure if they're just trying to be creepy or they just something bugs. Come on, come on, come on. Seriously, mate. I know I shot you in the face, but it's no excuse for just not paying attention. Come on. There we go. They sound so frustrated when I shoot them, is the thing. They're like, Ugh. oh, for fuck's sake, hang on a second. Right, if I'm doing this, we're doing this fucking Ash. We're doing this Ash Williams style. Sit the fuck down. Ow! Fucking really? So rude! Come on, come on, come on! Have some of that, you fuck! Does anyone else feel like being a fucking hero? I wonder. Oh! Oh! <laughs> well, we've got somebody who apparently has a massive dislike of chairs. And fuck off! Are you quite done? Are you quite done? Thank you. You massive arsehole. Uh, you... Oh god, more of them, really. Okay, fine. Is that a... Is that supposed to be electricity? I think it is. Oh god! Motherfucker! Fucking queefing in my face. Piss off. And... Double tap to the face. Oh, really? Come on. That was two... That was a... Two 12 gauge shells to the face. There we go. Come on. If that did not do you, I will be not. Imp I will not be impressed in the slightest. Are you dead? Are you dead? Good man. Right. You have done well, young Padawan. Now it is time for you to piss off and leave me alone. Where the fuck is that sound coming from? Is someone just popping a gigantic bag of bubble wrap? I can hear water and I can hear electricity. I can only assume this is a bad combination of those two things. Right, let's head up here. Anything through here? Nope. Oh, God. Yeah, we get the general idea. You guys are fucking tough. Hang on a second. Right, have I got anything else? Right. Fuck all your bullshit. Just in its entirety. Like, what are you throwing at me that changes colour when you throw it? Come on. Oh, fuck. Hell, like, I must have... Right. Come on. There we go. <laughs> they sound like I'm fighting fucking Rufus. God damn it, would you just... <sighs> Fuck off. God, you just... Oh my god, really? Are you quite... Fuck off. Did that do it for you? <laughs> Why would you die? Just... Just... Give it a fucking rest, would you? Oh my... <sighs> so 
Don't have shotgun, do not fail me now. Fucking just give it a rest. Oh my god. Have I just attacked a Highlander now? Is this dude just not killable under any conventional means? He does keep... Okay, you seem like you're just having a gentle lie down there. I want you to just... Please bear with me on this. There we go. There we go. Please. Please tell me that was enough. Is he down? Is he down? Look, mate who's apparently shitting blood all over the lighting fixtures. Is he down? I think he's dead. Wonderful. Wonderful. It only took a thousand fucking shots to take him down. Okay. Right. So that says nothing that way. Seriously, that is a, that is a deeply concerning sound. Okay. Right. Oh, more of you fuckers. I am just not in the mood for your horseshit anymore. Is that you dead? No, of course it isn't. <sighs> well, I'm, I'm assuming you're here for the riveting fucking gameplay, because it's mostly going to be me shooting these mooks for the next 30 years. <laughs> Come on. Come on, fucking really. Are you quite done? Do any more? Any more of those? One of the day for good measure. There we go. Oh dear, I'm actually quite low on ammunition for this now. That's not great. Grab all of this. Aha! Fantastic. Right. We are going to properly save again. I've just... I've, I've, I've now just come to the conclusion. We're just going to run this. We are just going to fucking steel ball run this bullshit. Because I am done. I am so done with all the horseshit this game is trying to play right now. We are just going to cheese it through. Come on, you motherfucker. Oh, yeah, I, I distinctly sense... Oh, and now the music's come back. Oh, dear. Excuse me. Fuck off. Seriously? That was like five bullets centre to the skull. There we go. One through the jaw. Did that do it? Where do you keep your brain, if I may ask? Because it's clearly not in your head. Come on. Come on. Okay, I think he's down now. Oh, lordy. Oh, don't you give me that bullshit. Nope, he does seem to be dead. This is encouraging. Come on, you fucker. Yeah, he's definitely not moving. Oh, God. Really? Whoa! A second, let me treat you fuckers to a nice tasty dose of vitamin G. Now some of this. That may have done it. Let's see. Come on. Come on. Does anyone fancy being a hero? No. Fantastic. That's exactly what I want to see. Total lack of willingness to engage in the enemy. Right through here. I've got a feeling these guys are all dead. Dead, dead. I'm just going to have to take it as red now that anyone on the floor is already dead. Whoop! Excuse me. Fuck off. <laughs> At this point, can I just run by? I mean, one shot to the head at the very least knocks them down. I just don't know if I need to do any more than that. Oh. Well, I pulled the lever. Precisely what effect it achieved, I have not, not entirely certain. Come on. Oh. There's farty leaking from underneath the door. That's probably not a great sign. Fuck off. Oh, god damn it! really, with your bullshit. Just... Oh, excuse me. There we go. Right. Moving swiftly forward. Anything? Anything? No. Just all this bullshit they've got on them. Okay. Well, we clearly need to go somewhere. Can we go through here? No. Okay, so we've gone... Ah. Up the stairs and to the left. Yeah, this must be a precursor to the original um, to the original game. Okay, in here, to the left. Fuck off. Right, where have we got to go now? Down here. He's already down. Oh, fuck, there's a few of them. Come on. Come on. Oh, lordy. Oh, well, might as well. While you're here, I'll give you a fucking taste. Whoop! Excuse me. Oh, damn it. Don't make me loot. Don't make me waste my ammunition, you bastard. Come on. Damn! 
Fine, fine. I'll give you a little buddy Oz. There we go. Really? More of you? Fuck off. Okay, alright. Well. Oh, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you some more. Whoop! Excuse me. Wow, really? I just staggered you. There we go, right to the dome. Come on, you fucker. Whoop. Have that, you little bastard. Okay. Push forward a little bit more. I am almost entirely out of explosives now. Right, up the stairs we go. Whew. I think we might be there. Ooh. Oh, God. More of you. Really? Just frustrating bullet sponge enemies. Not really my cup of tea. Admittedly, you're not that difficult to fight, but you just take an ludicrous amount of punishment. Do I have another grenade knocking around, I wonder? Yes, I have a grenade. Excuse me, excuse me. I have to say, that was an incredibly unceremonious death. He just got to went, oh, oh, no, I'm done. Oh, fucking would you. Come on, come on. Just fucking lie down. Good lord. Right. Nothing through here, nothing through here. Nothing to grab through there. I've done this all without any health pickups as well, which is marginally impressive. Actually, no way. I did get one or two, didn't the I? The entire team, except for you, is exterminated. And you managed to survive and find us. Wait, what? This comes in handy. The brain is seriously damaged indeed, and we need a donor urgently. Well, I don't get it. It's easy. Belov is your father, and the prototype's father of some kind. Wait, what? You're very similar to the prototype genetically. What? You are a perfect donor. Colonel, it's nonsense. Who is Belov? What kind of donor? No time to explain. Take him I, away. I, Don't move. We need Don't to destroy even breathe. him. Now. Motherfucker, really? Thanks, Lieutenant. Prepare oh. <laughs> the equipment fast. Put it on the table. Pull out the prototype. Give that man a raise. Blam. Keep your eye on the situation. <coughs> well, we. I mean, what the fuck? Oh, dream sequence now. Damn. But of course. But yeah. Probably. So, what's up with you? I died in the cryo chamber. Brain was ruined. Body was still functioning, but the head My case was. is the exact opposite. It happens. So, what's next? Hell if I know. It seems to be a sign. Listen, uh, what's your name? Artem. Artem, we need to get revenge on this bastard. Maybe somehow we will. I have no idea what's going on. This is the time. A year of shit. ago, they tried to take. Oh God, no! Who? The team of Colonel Danilov. Colonel, a clever person, found notes about you in some old papers. He investigated the matter. He even found Belov, who was locked in a mental hospital. And when he learned everything, he founded an operation of deployment into the town. He even brought a brain donor for you. He wanted to sell you somewhere abroad. The Colonel's mission was a failure. His entire team was killed in Glacier. I was in here by accident. I like walking around, you know. Well, I have my ways. So I went there, and he was left all alone. I locked you in your cell again, and the colonel was almost dead. I took him to my place, took care of him, talked to him a lot. Such a clever person he is. I told him about the transmitter. The transmitter? How do you think the virus does not spread out of the town limits? There's a transmitter installed on the TV tower. It works constantly. The virus is set to its frequency. The virus, it's, how to put it, isn't ripe yet. It's like that. Hell, it's hard to explain to you. You're uneducated. You sound like you're having a fucking mental breakdown. Keeps the virus alive, but without the transmitter's emission, the virus will be unable to exist. If the transmitter is turned off, the virus will die fast. But if you turn it to its full power, the virus will grow strong literally in a few hours, and it will get its own life. So, Danilov? So Danilov made me an offer. I helped him to get out of town. And he promised he'll come back. He will agree on a price. And after coming back, he will release the virus. And then get me, and you, and take us away. We will live on an island. Love is back. Mate, yes, I know. Mate, we need to find you, like, Grinder or something. Really? I'll stop him. 
and destroy the transmitter. But why, Artem? Because I'm not an Artem. I'm Andre Yagarov. Stop, Andre. <laughs> you want the shittest super weapon? My god! What did you inject me with? Fucking Windex. A cure for Dusk 12. What for? It's death to you, Artem. You are a creation of Dusk, so you will die. Not right away, but you don't have so much time. It's a pity, but you will have a chance to feel like a god Why? for a change. About 20 minutes before you die, your body will become almost invulnerable. Not for long, but the effect is How can interesting. I, do I will show you the entrance. <laughs> Oh my god, just out of nowhere, this game has broken the fucking barriers that I thought it was putting up for itself of just being like a, just to just buy the numbers, shoot the bad guys kind of thing, and it just attempted at the last second to bring up this entirely ham-fisted, oh but I can do a story too, sort of thing, and it's just the fucking worst. Oh my god. Also, why lens flare? Why lens flare all the time? I don't need that. Also, now I can use a gun. Just, just because. Fuck your shit. Man, this is a disappointing mini gun. Come on, fuck off you assholes. Wait, do I have infinite ammo for this? Okay, this is good. This is something I can get behind. Right. Oh, over we go. So I suppose I'm just kind of going in, uh, going in like on the floor something, am I? Cool. Fuck off! Fuck your shit! You fucking assholes! That this is perversely satisfying. I'll stop. Right up and up through here. Might as well free fire. Get some of that, you shit. Get some of that. I mean, at this point, there's no sense to me. Oh my god! Actually, no, no, because anyone. I, would, oh, I may have to put photosensitive epilepsy fucking warnings on this one because Jesus. Also, fuck your crotch. Fuck your crotch entirely. <laughs> I'm a child, I don't care! Have some of this, you fucks. Fuck off! Get away from me, you little shits! Fuck off! Where am I now? Oh, I'm over here, right. What's with that? Really? Really? An axe? You guys have no fucking chance. Never bring a knife to a Gatling gun fight. In fact, don't bring anything less than a Gatling gun to a Gatling gun fight, otherwise you're in a lot of trouble. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Through here? We're through here. Right. Oh, no, hang a second. Let me switch through. Uh, but over. Right. Ah, and down here. Because, but of course. This makes total sense. Seriously, like... <laughs> a few times... Like, I would just like to say, Half-Life 2 knows how to do this kind of stuff well. Where you're realising, okay, I can't get the... I can't take the direct route through oh. here, so I will find some other way around. Dust 12 just kind of goes, you just know to go through here. It's cool. Like, I, I just don't understand why. Right, how am I supposed to get... Wait, was I not supposed to fall? Wait. Okay, there's... How do I get up there? The game seems to be encouraging me to do something that I can't do. Uh, no, wait, what? Uh, okay, let me just stop for a second. Think about this critically. I. Oh, hang on a second. Maybe if I. Nope, not that. Okay, well, there's that. Does this mean there's other hatches I have to find, I wonder? Nope. I was going to say, like, the minigun is pretty much com commonly thought of as the master key when it comes to brute forcing away through things, but apparently not. Um. Yeah, is there another? Is there another hatch around here I missed? Maybe? Uh, no. No, not really. Shit. Well, whoa. You just, have to, you just have to tap them out and he goes, whoa. Nice. Okay, well, 
this is odd, because it's not really giving me any kind of indication of how I'm supposed to get over there. Right, go, 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 go. And that's genuinely not a way I can force my way through the wall, is it? I mean, that's a deep how that goes on. It's not actually something that I can break through, is it? No, 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 that's literally just for the, just for the sake of giving me a sense of accomplishment. Right. Nothing through there, nothing through there. I have to go through here. And then I'm here. Now, from this vantage point, what do I do? I... I really don't have an idea. I get the impression the game is actually trying to make me, um... Is doing what it did with that fucking barge right at the beginning of the game as well, where it's like, oh no, you have to go over here and climb up this non specified climbable piece of structure. Because if you don't give me any sense of being able to do that earlier on in the game, I'm never gonna fucking work it out. And there's no ledge, there's no there's no way of me getting extra like I could climb this. I'm not in fantastic shape, and I could go up leg up onto here, grab onto this, shimmy across, climb onto there, get onto that. But no, no, the game has gone, nah mate, no, you'll have to find some other fucking way of doing this. Oh my good fucking grief. Okay, right, up. No, right. Rather than wasting your time, and wasting my time, we are going to break for a moment, and I'm going to find how I'm supposed to get through this part, and when we return, we are going to finish this fucking game. I'm not going to be beaten, not now. Alright, thank you very much for watching, and well, I, I don't know why I'm saying that. We'll be back in just a second, okay?